Welcome to the Madison Library Program, Pachakacha. I'm Nancy Sullivan. Here's our staff dressed up for Western Day during Spirit Week. Linda's our textbook clerk, Wendy's our library assistant. They each work half time. I'm the school librarian here. What some people don't know is that school librarians are licensed teachers. I hold a master's in education, teaching license, and educational media endorsement. In September, every ninth grade language arts class comes in for two sessions of library orientation. Session one, students explore the different parts of the physical library in groups and then present what they've learned to the rest of their class. Session two, they get an introduction to all the online resources students have access to through our library webpage. We couldn't run the library without the support of our wonderful TAs. Library TAs perform duties in support of our entire school community. Their customer service jobs include check-in and check-out, shelving books, helping other students find materials, and even watering plants and arranging furniture for events. Students receive a letter grade and an elective credit. Wendy puts on a banana social in the hallway in front of the library at the beginning of every school year. Students receive free organic bananas topped with chocolate sauce and peanuts in exchange for telling her which is their favorite book. It was heartwarming this year to hear students cite our previous Madison Reads books as their favorites. I'll talk more about that program in exactly three minutes. One morning in October each year, we fill the library with sofas and kids who've gotten special permission to attend. We lock the doors, get cozy, and read all morning. During our break, we have a special breakfast from Whole Foods and treats like Voodoo Donuts, and every high school library in PPS is having a read-in at the exact same time. I'm a professional. My school library standards are tied to national common core information technology and subject area standards. I'm also a licensed teacher. I collaborate with classroom teachers across all subjects and grade levels to teach essential research and information literacy skills, including MLA format, which is important for college success. Class Connections is where students can find resources to support classroom learning. We post assignment sheets, scoring guides, project instructions, and more. Video book talks are a good example of what can be found here. They are used for student assessment in many classes and serve more than one purpose. Kids can use them as models or discover books they might enjoy. ORCA, the Oregon Reader's Choice Award, is a statewide school library program where students read from a list of books and choose their favorite. The award is intended to be a fun and exciting way for youth to become enthusiastic and discriminating readers. Students choose their favorite book in a real-life democratic process. Madison's Voting Pizza Party will be held in March. OBOB is the Oregon Battle of the Books. Students are exposed to quality literature representing a variety of literary styles and viewpoints. The program encourages and recognizes students who enjoy reading, broadens reading interests, and improves reading comprehension while promoting cooperative learning and teamwork. Madison Battles commence in February. We participate in the Literary Arts Program Students to the Schnitz, where we take students downtown for author lectures. In addition, we host multiple notable author visits every year. The benefits of bringing students together with authors include motivation to read more of an author's work, encouragement to pursue writing, and insights into the writing process. Fundraising efforts include the used book drive and book sale happening in January this year, the flower basket sale held the day before Mother's Day, and a variety of ongoing grant and project opportunities through organizations like Donors Choose, Oregon Association of School Libraries, Multnomah County Library, and the Oregon Reading Association. Like Multnomah County Library's Everybody Reads, Madison Reads is our all-community reads program. During January and February, we read the chosen book. In March, the author comes to spend the day with us doing readings, Q&A sessions, writing workshops, and book signings. The first year we read The Girl Who Fell From the Sky, then Robopocalypse, and this year Trafficked. Poetry Out Loud is a national poetry recitation contest created by the National Endowment for the Arts and the Poetry Foundation. POL competitors start at the classroom level and advance to a school-wide event held in our library in February. The school winner goes on to the state competition and potentially to the national finals. Every year I'm amazed by our students' talent. Open Mic is held every second Tuesday after school in the Art Gallery. It's an opportunity for students and staff to share their talents, especially our incredible poets. We've seen and heard everything from singing, prose pieces, and skits, to breakdancing, juggling, and headstands. I'm not even kidding. Everyone's invited to perform or just have a snack and enjoy the show. Madison's Poetry Slam happens in April, National Poetry Month. It's a well-attended evening event where students perform their original poetry for a supportive and appreciative audience made up of students, staff, and family. Local celebrity poets serve as judges, scoring performances 1 through 10 like at the Olympics. The top three-point getters win cash, prizes, and glory. 
Madison's winners advance to Verslandia, Portland's all-city high school poetry slam. Our students compete against winning poets from the other slams hosted by all PPS high school librarians. The event is produced by Literary Arts and sponsored by Wyden and Kennedy. Last year's winners received iPads and gift cards. We're hoping to add a scholarship to the list of prizes. A big part of the school library program is literature promotion. We are very fortunate to have a true artist in our library assistant, Wendy. We collaborate on ideas, but she's the one who keeps us captivated with her clever and engaging book displays, bulletin boards, and tabletop creations, which often tie in with what's happening in the library, school, and world beyond Madison. Two clubs I advise are the Library Rats and Anime Club. The Library Rats, readers and thinkers, meet monthly to select books to read and have lively discussions and cookies. Anime Club is an energetic group of fans, incredibly knowledgeable about all things Japanese. They read books and magazines, play games, create drawings, watch movies, and do costumed role play. The Writing Center, housed in the library, is a place where students of all grade levels and writing abilities can seek assistance for any writing assignment or project. Writing coaches are available most days and times to assist students with every stage of the writing process. Their goal is to improve writing skills. Students can also get help with college applications, scholarship essays, and resumes. There are lots of ways you can engage with our library. I welcome volunteers. Find out about activities and events on our website, see photos on Flickr, follow our YouTube channel, become a writing coach, attend our events, or support our fundraisers. Oh, and kids check out and read a lot of great books from our library, too.